Assalamualaikum, my name is Rabia. Assalamualaikum, my name is Maria. Welcome to Malaysian Generations Nepal. Today we are going to react on the Darbuka who took on 200 soldiers with only one hand. Okay, one, okay. And what's your name? Simple History. Okay, this is interesting. Yes. Let's watch it. Let's the Gurkha who took on 200 soldiers with only one hand. 1945, World War II. From mid-1944, the tides of war were changing for the Japanese army in Burma. Commanded by General Sir William Slim, Chindik guerrillas, American troops and Chinese troops forced the Japanese forces into a state of constant retreat. For almost a year, fighting continued across the boundless jungles of Burma. One unit that saw a lot of action in Burma was the 4th Battalion of the 8th Gurkha Rifles. They were part of the 89th Indian Brigade who were ordered in the spring of 1945 to make a maneuver across the Irrawaddy River to cut the route of the Japanese forces towards Taungda. As always, the Gurkhas were the first in. It was May 12, 1945 when the 4th Battalion arrived at the village of Taungda and established camp. As most of the unit fell asleep, small forward positions were established to protect the camp from surprise attacks. During the night, 200 Japanese soldiers decided to surprise the Gurkhas and to break their way towards Taungda. The first line of defense they encountered was a small trench manned by Lakaman Gurung and two other soldiers. This trench was positioned on the jungle road that led straight to the camp. If Gurung's position was overrun, the entire camp would have been endangered. At 1.20 a.m., Japanese grenades started to fall on Gurung's trench. Gurung managed to grab the first bomb that fell in the trench and threw it back. He did the same with the second, but was too late for the third. It dropped right in front of the trench, and as Gurung lunged to grab it, it exploded right in his hand when he tried to throw it back. His right hand was severely damaged. Fingers were blown off and his entire hand was shattered. Burning shrapnel pounded his face, body, and right leg. Two other soldiers were also badly wounded and put completely out of action. But not Garung. He took out his kukuri knife, stuck it in front of his trench, and yelled at the enemy, promising them that not one of them would pass by his knife. Without his right hand and bleeding all over the place, Garung continued to fight. He took his bulk action Lee Enfield and started to shoot at Japanese soldiers who were trying to rush the position. They were welcomed by the now one-handed Gurung, who yelled, Come and fight a Gurkha. Using only his left hand to reload and fire a rifle, Gurung was waiting for every single Japanese soldier that approached his trench to shoot them. For four entire hours, Gurung was holding his position alone, killing every enemy soldier that came close to him. As he saw it, he was about to die anyway, so he decided to go out with a fight. Being a Gurkha, Backing down was not an option. Early in the morning, his comrades relieved Gurung, who had lost a lot of blood. 31 Japanese soldiers lay dead in front of his spot. His efforts inspired other soldiers to hold off waves of Japanese attacks for another two nights and three days. For his gallantry, Lakeman Gurung was awarded with the Victoria Cross by the Viceroy of India, Lord Louis Mountbatten, at a parade at the Red Fort in Delhi on December 19, 1945. Lakeman Gurung's actions in combat were an example of the bravery and commitment Gurkhas demonstrated during the Second World War. Even though he had lost his sight in his right eye and lost his right hand, Gurung would continue to serve with the 8th Gurkhas. After completing his service in 1947, he returned to his village in Nepal to become a farmer. On December 12, 2010, Lakaman Gurung died at the age of 92. Subscribe and click the notification bell for more World War II videos. much stress but can you imagine yes, good <laughs> <laughs> he lost his right hand but then he can kill Still fighting. Yes, yeah. 200 soldiers with only one hand yeah. 
that's why people scared with Gurkha. Don't mm. mess with Gurkha. Do it. Do it. Do it. <laughs> they are brave. Mm. Gurkha known as a brave soldier. Yeah, I, I'm still my <laughs> goosebumps. Yeah, because of I course. could, I couldn't imagine it. I couldn't imagine it. I couldn't imagine, Don't imagine. it. <laughs> because see, we 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 watched the animation, mm -hmm. and we already amazed and shocked and everything with mm -hmm. this. And then, <laughs> if we watch it, the the real situation, I don't know what to say. Yeah, the spirit is there. So much respect. Is oh. there anything that you want? Yeah, <laughs> I'm I'm keep thinking when he threw back the green net. Yeah. First, and second, but the third, he was late just right. a bit, and this happened. Yeah. Mm. That's all I want to say. <laughs> okay, thanks, Maria. <laughs> all right, guys, thank you so much for your support. If you like this video, please share it with your family members and friends. Don't forget to share it on your social media as well. Please subscribe our channel, Malaysian Girl Reactions Nepal, and follow our Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and also TikTok, Malaysian Girl Reactions. Thank you so much. Till next time. Assalamualaikum. Assalamualaikum.